Councilmember and National Governor, first of all, thank you for your time. What do you think about what's happening with Occupy Oakland, the city's response, and where we go from here? You, you know, I, I think obviously Oakland is very supportive of the, uh, uh, of the issues that these demonstrators are, are articulating. Um, but I, think, I believe we have the, the, the duty and the responsibility to protect not only their rights, uh, but other people's rights. Right. Uh, businesses and people that work in downtown and the city of Oakland. So at some point you have to um, take action because you are responsible for that. Uh, so hopefully uh, people will understand that at the same time that we support the, the issues that they mm -hmm. are championing, mm -hmm. uh, we have the responsibility to protect life and property. Uh, not only people that are camped, they were in the camps, uh, but the people that live in downtown. Right. And right. that, so. But as a person who's been involved in the labor movement, and I mean, you go way back. This is kind of a weird position to be in. I mean, how do you do? You, do you think you know? I don't want to be the Ronald Reagan. You know what I mean? Isn't that kind of an odd place? Or are you? Or am I wrong? I mean, I don't. No, you're right. We are, but at the same time, you know, I believe that when you get elected to office, mm -hmm. you kind of lose a little bit of your. Of your of your uh, uh, option that you have, mm -hmm. you, you get elected to, with the responsibilities to protect people, uh, protect the rights of people, right. everyone's rights. Right. Uh, and unfortunately, sometimes you have to take action. Right. Uh, I hope that this, the people understand. You know that uh, their cause uh, uh, is a very important cause, mm -hmm. and it's going to be championed in a way that it doesn't infringe on other people's rights right. or affect other people or put all the people's lives in danger, and, and that's, that's the reason why we're taking action. Did the protesters try to talk with you guys? Because in Atlanta, where I just came from, there was a great dialogue. I, something broke down that was not associated with the mayor protester dialogue. But here, did the protesters try? I mean, was it, did they reject the city, or was it, or was it, you know? I believe they reject the city. I, I think that uh, uh, the city of Oakland tried. I think that the mayor's office tried. Mm -hmm. uh, unfortunately, I think that what happened is that um, uh, all the causes took, nah. took can, kind of took the uh, over, mm -hmm. and, and unfortunately, mm -hmm. it happens sometimes. Uh, but we have no option. We gotta, we gotta act. We gotta protect people. We gotta protect people. What rights. would you like to see done? If you could wave your magic wand, what would you like to see done? I would like to see that these, that these people understand that uh, we support their efforts, their their issues. At the same time, that. Uh, other people should not be affected. The business should not be affected. And unfortunately, that's happening. So we have to take action. Hey, Councilmember, thank you for your time. Really appreciate it. Okay.